This is the video for the stand pipe installation option, which is appropriate for pressure situations of 10 PSI or less. To choose the correct installation kit, measure the water pressure in the sample line that will connect to the Y strainer assembly. Install the analyzer indoors in an environment with minimum vibration. Bright light interferes with color metric measurement, and heat can cause reagents to degrade. Select a sampling point location in the process stream that will pull a good representative sample for the analyzer. The sample line and location is critical for accurate readings. Attach the analyzer to a wall using your preferred mounting method. Make sure that the analyzer is level. Attach the controller to a wall, panel, or pipe. Install the analyzer near an open drain, where the analyzer drain can be ratted with a continuous downward slope. Assemble the Y strainer before you begin installation at your location. When you install the Y strainer on the wall, make sure that the angled bypass port points down. Make sure that the flow arrow on the Y strainer points toward the analyzer. Make sure to install the external air brake, which decreases condensation and possible corrosion inside the analyzer. Assemble the standpipe before you begin installation at your location. Make sure that the top of the standpipe is at least 24 inches above the top of the analyzer. Install one end of the black sample bypass tubing to the bypass port of the Y strainer. Push the other end of the tubing behind the conduit clamp and then into the standpipe. Assemble the grab sample assembly. Install the left side of the black sample tubing to the Y strainer outlet. Install the other end of the black sample tubing to the inlet port of the analyzer. Inspect the tubing using the grab sample assembly to ensure the system is leak free. Make sure the stand pipe is drained securely. Install the tubing harness.
Follow the steps in the user manual to mix the DPD and the indicator solution. Install the reagent bottles. Install the stir bar. Close the shutoff valve at the Y strainer inlet. Open the upstream valve to supply water to that shutoff valve. Fully open the shutoff valve at the Y strainer outlet. Slowly open the shutoff valve at the Y strainer inlet until a small stream of water comes out of the standpipe drain tubing. Connect the analyzer to the controller. Connect the controller to power. Confirm you have the latest software for the controller and analyzer. Set up and prime the reagents. For best analyzer performance, the flow rate should be set between 120 milliliters to 200 milliliters per minute. Measure the flow at the drain. Thank you.